Hello everyone! Welcome na naman tayo dito sa ating munting kusina. Welcome here at La Arnie's Kitchen and Food Creation. So please come join with me today as I'm going to um, cook ginisang ginamos. So ginamos eh, is a, one of the many comforting appetizer, I should say, sa mga kabisaya, ano? <laughs> so, ginamos is fermented diles. Diles is anchovies. O kung sa bisaya pa, bulinaw. So, I have here diff five different types of oil. And I will just choose one oil to saute our spices. Ito po ay 100% extra virgin olive oil. This is vegetable oil. And this is 100% pure avocado oil. And this is mustard oil and sesame. 100% sesame, sesame oil. So out of five, I'll just use this olive oil to saute as a main uh, saute ingredient. And this is our Diles Ginamos that you can always find this from any of your favorite Asian stores or grocery stores that uh, <clears throat> is selling this type of I item. Now, in the Palenque wet market back home in the Philippines, there's a lot of that. So our spices are the following. I have your finely chopped red cooking onions, lots and lots of kamatis. This type of kamatis is cherry tomatoes. I have here finely, um, finely sliced of this ginger and lots and lots of this garlic or ajos or bawang. And I have here red uh, spiced red chili fingers i will just do that and add that towards the end to decorate and to make it more nicer and colorful i have here finely chopped uh, green onions that will be garnished towards the end so here in my cooking pot there you go i am going to add uh, approximately let's say six tablespoons of olive oil so whatever oil you have available in your pantry simply you can always go ahead friends i am using medium flame and then we're going to saute our spices once our oil is heated up first of all i'm going to saute that ginger so it will become a little bit toasty and crunchy then secondly i'm going to add that uh, garlic pounded chopped liqueurs uh, sliced garlic and also this red cooking onions you can use white cooking onions depending upon your availability remember friends cooking and baking they're always make fun and easy here at our little kitchen it also gives you the ideas on what to prepare for your family's next meal. My simple goal in my kitchen is simply for fun, sharing, and learning. It also uh, makes me feel happy if I can share my simple ideas in both cookings and my bakings. Once our garlic and our um, ginger turns into golden brown and translucent then I'm going to add my red cooking onions So it's about time we're going to add our cherry tomatoes. Whatever tomatoes you have available, then you can always do that.
So I smash the tomatoes until it incorporates with the rest of uh, the spices. So it's about time that we're going to add our dinamos or anchovy sauce. So friends, different people, different cooks, moms and dads, aunties and uncles, they have their own different ways of cooking this guinamos or fermented anchovies or dillis. Cook it for another minute or so, then we're done. There you go. We have to mix it until well combined and adding or garnishing that with our uh, sibuyas dahon or green onions or scallions. There you go, friends. So it's done and we're going to add our red chilies. For decoration purposes to make it more colorful and lovely <laughs> once again I would like to say thank you wonderful friends and this is quite done and this is the outcome of our guinisang guinamos and eat moderately and uh, you know if you have some medical issues we should not or even if myself uh, I should not be eating this all the time. It's just for a matter of uh, little cravings and for my video and photo food collections. There you go, friends. And this is our Guinness, Guinnessang Guinamos. Once again, thank you. This is your uh, home cook, Buddy Laarni, saying, Daghan kaing salamat. Oh, by the way, napakoy leftover na rice. I will eat a little bit only and the rest will be given to a good friend of mine. Thank you.